So let's start with our game of the week in the NLL. Springfield in first place. They are 6-1 in league play. Anthony Wayne just a half game back at 6-2. Second half, it's a close one. Aiden Schmank, a huge rejection on defense, lets the Blue Devils know about it. But he's not done because just moments later, Parker Schofield rewards him on the other end. The senior converts inside. He went off for 20 points tonight. Generals up by three. Springfield proving tough. Eddie Merrill, the third, with a spin. The and one three-point play the hard way. That would keep the Devils in it. This game comes down to the final seconds. Blue Devils down three, 30 seconds to go. Jordan Combs finds Will Mays in the corner. That would tie things up at 56. Anthony Wayne decides not to call a timeout, so here we go. One shot for the win. Schofield from distance connects as time expires. Unbelievable finish. The students rush the court. Generals win 59-56. Tyler Segerman has more from White House. I am still shaking following that ending. I mean, what an unbelievable sequence of events here in White House to finish this game. And it's a big win for Anthony Wayne, too, because now the Generals improved to 7 2 in league play and remain in title contention. I mean, I can take credit for that last bucket, but Aiden and my teammates were there to carry me through the whole game. I mean, I was thinking drive, but he was giving me a lot of space, and I practiced that shot so many times. But. I can take credit for that last shot, but I give it to Aiden. I hit the shot, and then I remember in the locker room, that, that, whole, that whole thing was a blur. Yeah. Everyone running after me, that was, that was crazy. We, do, we always trust Parker in those type of situations. He hit one earlier in the year at Maumee, and I don't know, there's no one else I would run with the ball in that situation. I trust him. It's huge. Everyone feel like we've been counted out. We, got a, we had a rough stretch in the middle of the season, but you know, we're turning around, and scary team. You know, I try to tell the guys all the time, it's just super exciting to be in games and playing meaningful games in late January, and we put ourselves in a position to do that. We can't take anybody lightly. You know, tomorrow night we're going out to Columbia, and they're pretty good. Uh, next game is Perrysburg, so that's going to be a pretty fun game. But one thing I do want to mention is the crowd that we had here tonight. I mean, we were shoulder to shoulder all the way up home side. I mean, there was a lot of great atmosphere. This is, this is what high school basketball was all about tonight. Following tonight's dramatic victory, the NL is set up for a showdown next Friday as these Anthony Wayne Generals will travel to Perrysburg with first place and in all essence, a league title on the line. Whew, what a night of basketball. Isn't this fun, Jordan? In White House, Tyler Segerman, WTOL 11.